Hello, I'm David Leventhal, the local technical representative for 3M SATA Control Division, and today we're going to be talking about the 3M Model 701 Resistance to Ground Tester. It's an analog meter and two five-pound weights, which is uh, the two five-pound weights are in accordance with the ESD S20.20 .20 specification, and it, this tester enables us to test any conductive or dissipative surface. So we can use it to test mats, workbenches, ESD floors, ESD shelves. I'll show you how it works now. So we have the analog tester, two five-pound weights. We will put them on this work surface and test to see whether or not the work surface alone is an ESD safe material. The analog meter showing that the needle is not moving, so that's a insulative surface. To demonstrate that, if I put it on the piece of metal plate and hit the test button, you'll see that the meter is showing it's fully conductive. The specification for work surfaces, however, is that the meter needs to be and the material needs to be static dissipative, which is in the green range somewhere between fully insulated and fully conductive. So we'll measure that now by putting the two five pound weights on the mat, hit the test button, and this is in the static dissipative range. So now we know that the mat is static dissipative. But the next part of this test is we want to verify that the mat is properly grounded. So we'll take one of the probes and put it into the ground of the electrical outlet and we'll leave the other five pound weight on the mat. So we'll test that by doing that and we can see that the charge, any charge generated on the mat will go right to electrical ground at static dissipative rate. That's how simple it is to use this meter, the 3M701.